I mean, come on, look at it. Doesn't it look good? But yeah, the whole goal of the game chat is just like, build up resources, build a base, hope that your base is good enough to survive through you not being on the game. It's like a big game of Among Us. It's just a game where you just harass your friends. Anyone I see, I find your base, I might just blow into it. So chat, let me fill you in. So I played for like five or six hours yesterday for the first time ever. I got access yesterday and I played for like, played for like seven hours. Just got caught up in Rust things. If you guys know anything about Rust, you're gonna feel right at home here, but you basically live in a perpetual world. Even when you log out of the game, your character is asleep wherever you logged out. The map is populated with other players, uh, lootables, gear, you build a base, uh, you can blow into other people's base, rob, steal, make friends, make enemies. It's crazy. And you just hope that when you log in, your stuff's not just gone. Right, so th this is an er like early, earlier stages, chat. But I've, I've, I had a lot of fun playing it yesterday, and I definitely want to play more. So here we are in my lovely little one by one. Um, I've got, I've got. TB, sister, I've got guns, I've got it. Uh, I've got some good stuff that I need to research. So before I lose it all, I need to go find enough scrap to make a workbench, okay? So I can start researching some of the stuff and I'm gonna need even more scrap to research that stuff. So we're gonna go out in the fields, hope to not get killed, grab the supplies, bring them back, and we'll be good. Hello? But chat, I mean, come on, look at it. Doesn't it look good? So one of the biggest differences I'm gonna point out here is gonna be the fact that we're on Mars chat in comparison to normal Rust. Uh, we are on Mars, but everything else is gonna look very, very similar. So if you're familiar with Rust, you'll feel right at home here. Uh, just like if you're familiar with Tarkov, you can kind of fit in and Tabor uh, very well. Looks like it's getting dark though, chat. We're gonna have to slum it. Um, I think Short Stack is on. I don't know where he is, but if I see him, I don't know. I, I think I have a bullet for him. Let me make sure my guns are loaded. Got a nice crossbow that we pulled. Pretty fun to reload and shoot. Uh, did pull a shotgun, but I need scrap chat, so. How things work is you start off with some basic crafting recipes, um, but all the good stuff like guns and, oh boy. Uh, guns and higher end things, they're just, they're just, uh, you have to find the items themselves, craft a research table, put it on the research table, supply it with enough ingredients to actually research it, you turn it into a blueprint, and then you can craft that from then on. So I have a bunch of guns that I want to turn into blueprints so that even if I do die or get raided and lose all of my stuff, um, I'll, they can't steal my knowledge, chat. They can't steal my ideas. Uh, <laughs> so researching good guns early is always a really important strat, in my opinion. Unless you lose it all. So we can get scrap by breaking things down. Uh, we can get them out of barrels, out of containers, and we'll find a lot of that stuff at monuments. Um, in this case, inside this dome here, uh, there's a bunch of buildings, a little compound here. We might be able to scrap up what we need. Just gonna pick some mushrooms up on the way. Uh, my shotgun went somewhere. I don't know when it dropped, but it dropped at some point. Is there AI? There are animals so far. I don't think... I'm still pretty new to the game, chat. Like I said, I started yesterday. I'm still learning and figuring things out. To my knowledge, I haven't seen any AI, uh, like enemies, like in Rust. Um, I'm sure it's on the to-do list. But, uh, yeah, I haven't seen anything like that yet. Let's get in this compound. Maybe I'll find the shotgun later. Where's Braddy Daddy at? All right, so we can take a little pickaxe. We can chop this barrel up. It takes about four hits. And we'll break down. And then we can just grab this stuff and drop it on our back to loot it up. And we'll 
we'll see what else we can find here. I'm basically just going to be breaking every single barrel and looting every single container. I might want to start with a high ceiling one. Because I don't know if Short Stack has been here lately. Basically, stuff will respawn over time. And it's just this big map that we all share. Um, so Short Stack or other players may have come through here already and picked up the loot. And it's all on respawn still. Um, but I don't know unless I get through here and check. Ooh, there is a container here. Maybe we'll be good. There's a little bit of food. Mm. I'm gonna eat and drink this stuff now. While we run around. More crates, this is good. The candy. Ooh, okay. Backup armor with the spacesuit. But yeah, I'm running out of oxygen over time. Uh, we live on Mars, so there's these refilling stations. These are the biggest differences between this game and Rust. Um, I think that's kind of it. You'll see these giant domes because there's no oxygen, right, on Mars. So the only place that there's actually trees are going to be within the giant domes. But you can still travel. Uh, <laughs> the map is pretty massive. Timeless has been... The map is very, very massive. Timus has been gaslighting me into thinking that there's only two glass domes on the map. I'm pretty sure there's at least three, if not way more. Um, so there's lots of different areas you can go. It's kind of interesting. Oh, we get a syringe and more bandages, good healing items. It's kind of interesting that you have to go to these like special areas to get trees. Uh, so it'll create a lot of scenarios where you know we can PvP and fight other players or just meet other people. In these in these kind of hot spots, that's pretty neat. Hi, chat. This game is called Grim. It is very early testing. Chat, you know how often I'm gonna say this? Can you guys help me to all the new people coming in? So Combat Waffle Studios is publishing it. Uh, Spoonfed is the main mastermind behind it. Um, and yeah, we're in really really early days. If you can help tell all the new people this, because it's gonna get asked probably a billion times. I can almost guarantee it. Uh, but yeah, I'm just going to keep breaking barrels here. We need to get the scrap chat. I'm kind of hoping short stack shows up. Because I, I want to practice using this bow on him. <laughs> short stack, come through. Let me PVP you. I should eat the rest of the food chat. I just want it out of my inventory. Can we stack? Ground, keep looting. Uh, I think I picked this building clean. There's day night cycles in the game, so eventually it will get bright again. We should probably climb the tower now, chat. Hello? I thought I heard something. Green's asking how long I'm gonna stream. I don't know. Yeah, pinning it for new people will be good, Benji. <laughs> Chat, if you guys ever see me looking at my hand like this, I'm reading you. Chat, you're on the back of my hand. All right, let's break the other barrel. Little more scrap. Mm. And I want to climb this big tower. There's good uh, weapon boxes up here. It's just climbing is, you have to be very um, precise when you climb. If you miss put a hand, on a rung, then you're you're pretty much dead. Fall damage is a big deal in this game. So I'm gonna try and climb this without getting myself killed. Going slow is best, and making sure your hand is actually grabbed on a rung before you transfer. And let go of your other hand is important. Nice and easy. Nice and easy, hand over fist. I don't wanna die here. 
all up. Okay, I'm up. Uh, what do we got? Give me big stuff. Oh, C4? Bruh, I gotta research this now. I'm gonna start blowing into everyone's bases. Oh my god. We can start raiding with C4. I just need to research it. Oh my god, we can start raiding with C4. Now I'm concerned. So when you get a big hit like this, and one of the boxes, like... I'm out here... Uh, I can get killed at any moment. Similar to Tabor. Except just everybody's just here. So hopefully I'll make it out by myself, because there's not too many people on. But you never know here. Uh, uh, wait, a quick drop stuff. Who needs extra beds? Actually, I could break the bed down, probably. Oh, chat, I need to get out of here. I want to hit up the recycler before we leave, though. I do- I should go store this instantly. Hmm. Alright, I need to get out of here. Okay, easy does her. Easy does her. Go down the ladder. Very carefully, chat. Oh my god, I almost let go. Oh my god. That could have been it. Easy. Precise. Down we go. I'm at the bottom. Okay, I gotta get home with this stuff, chat. Chat, I have to get home with this stuff. I don't want to stop here at the recycler, but I should just get home. I need to secure the uh, C4. Okay, so if that's there... Where I'm going? Getting out of here. Oh shit! Hey, wait! I'm sorry! Hello? Yeah, yeah, Ted, what up? Yo, how's it going, man? I go um, I'll be uh, you're good by the way. I'm not even I'm not streaming. I'm too tired to stream. Okay. I'm just chilling today. Oh. Just chilling. Um yeah. I am going to be right back here. I need to do some stuff with the recycler. Are you going to be hanging around? Uh did you already check the tower? Uh I have checked the tower. Yes. Okay. Well, that's all I was coming for. I'm okay. Just, I was just going to Today it's just like I'm just getting resources. You know, farm up. So yeah, farm up just to have everything ready for maybe a stream tomorrow. Oh, fun. Yeah, dude, do it. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'll am i probably be way. around here pretty often, so come come say hi every so often. Okay. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bounce. I'll be right back. Chad, I've got too much good stuff on me. I gotta get out of here. I would have engaged in combat, but... I don't want to risk... I don't want to risk losing it. Should keep this on me though, just in case. I don't want to risk losing that. That was artificial actor chat. We gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. <laughs> Is he following me? I hope he's not watching me. Okay, let's turn our light off. Get me out of here. Get me out of here, Chet. Okay, so this is where you refill up your oxygen tanks. You just run by it. It'll play a noise most of the time. Um, and if we open our inventory here, you see at the top left? So 1,500 se seconds with for a full tank of oxygen before you need to refill again. Those refill stations are placed around these uh, monuments from what I've noticed. Um, so... It's not as bad as you might think, having an air tank that you need to go and refill. Uh, but it is something you need to be mindful of, because you will pretty much insta-die without oxygen. That's for sure. Wait, how many bucks do we get for watching this? Uh, you'll find out at the end. Yeah, only a very small amount of people are, are testing this game right now. It's very early. 
but I'm impressed <laughs> with how early it is and how well it's running. Uh, alright chat, I'm back home. Let's store... I definitely want to store... the extra stuff. I've got suits for fucking days. Okay, what do I want to break apart? I don't know if I can break down everything. I'm not sure what breaks down and what doesn't. But... I am gonna take... I think I just break down all the pipes and stuff. Maybe this breaks down. The door will definitely break down. I mean, I could be wrong. Um, what else do I want to leave behind? We got an extra pickaxe. We can leave that behind. This for sure. Uh, we've got extra meds. I'll leave the extras behind. Bandages would be good to keep. I don't know if we can break the light down, but we'll try. And then we can store the extra food. Who needs a rock? I think we're good. Everything else I want to keep. Alright. Uh, is there anything else I want to break? I don't think so. Ooh, my furnaces are off, though. <gasps> I wonder if it's all done. I should get the furnaces running, chat. Oh, let me grab some wood. Uh, uh, grab half of it. Keep the rest in the tool chest. Open! Good night, Minnie. Okay, I think I have all my metal in here. Wow, it went through most of it. I'm gonna see if I have any other ore to smelt down, but we are sitting on some goodies. Mm. Put the metal away. I don't think I have extra ore. Yeah, that's everything. All right, let's go. I've got 50 here, but that's it. And come back and cook that. All right, I'm going back. Uh, I'm gonna try and break all this stuff down at the recycler. See if we can get the scrap we need to start researching some of these parts. I want to research the C4 now, chat. I know I need an airlock. I'll make one eventually. But you're not wrong. Can you put the light in your base so we can see? I think so. I just need electricity set up. Like, you can already wire electricity up in this game. So... I just need to set all that stuff up and get it. I'm still in the very, very early stages. But my, the most important thing in any Rust game that you play is you got to get blueprints on lock, like ASAP. Because if you're like stockpiling resources, cool, you might lose it all by getting raided. And then what? You just got to redo all that work. But like I said, people can't steal the blueprints from you once you learn them. So we rush those. So we know how to make everything. And then we can flush the base out. Um... But we're going to stay tunnel vision focused on getting scrap to research these things. The scrap chat. Scrap, scrap, scrap. That's all I want. Pick up some food along the way. Welcome back, K9. I do stream tomorrow. We'll be starting at 3.30 p.m. Pacific Standard. Am I down in Ohio? This might be Ohio. Damn, if Artie would have gunned me down there, <laughs> he would have got so much stuff. Uh, I'm thankful he didn't. Artie, are you still hanging out here? I'm just pickaxing barrels. Nothing suspicious going on here. How's my health? Almost full. It's bandage. I, 
think the bandage should heal my health up. Chat, tell me if the health goes up from that. Does it work? Or is it like bandages only heal up to a certain point and I need to use like a syringe? I think bandages should work. No? Yes? Yes? It's working, chat? Okay, good. My chocolate. Ah, uh, barrels! Alright, I should get the uh, recycler going. So in here, chat. We can get this machine running. We have to camp it and stay close to it. But we can at least run this machine. And break down some of these these materials and resources to get scrap and other things that I want. Let's see if the light breaks down. Oh, yeah. Now, one thing I've noticed is it stops. I don't know what the conditions are, but that thing will stop if I, like, walk away from it. I don't know if it's walking away that's causing it or what. Oh, it's still running. It's good. I think maybe it's when it moves to a new type of item. Luckily, there's a bunch of pipes for it to go through. So I'm going to let that thing run. We'll look for a few more barrels out and about. I'm probably going to need some wood. We can go chop some trees, chat. Oh, there's a box in here. Food? Am I full on food? Should I stop wasting this? No, I'm not. Ooh, that computer will be good. The targeting computer, we can break that down for scrap. But yeah, the whole goal of the game chat is just like, build up resources, build a base, hope that your base is good enough to survive through you not being on the game, because other people are still playing uh, while you're offline. They could blow into your base, steal all your stuff. Uh, and then you just try and build up from there. And just, the, the the longer you survive in a base without your stuff getting stolen, the the, the, the more high-end gear and kits that you can get to bring out, um, you can start blowing up other people's, uh, people's bases and stealing their, their goodies. So it's just kind of this long, vicious cycle of trying to build up and then getting smashed to the ground because you got raided and lost everything. Uh, and then you just do that again and you try and try and keep the power rolling um it, it's it's quite a fun gameplay loop in my opinion how many of you guys know about rust press one if like you're familiar with how rust works let's go check on the um little scrap machine i'm gonna gauge you guys where's the scrap machine Press two if you've never, yeah, played Rust at all. I want to see my two pressers out there too. There's got to be a handful of you. Rust is pretty popular though. See, yeah, I just went through this first stack of pipes and then stopped. Hmm. Weird. So I might have to babysit this chat. I don't want to though. I guess we'll babysit it in chat. I just want to turn this thing on, go do other stuff, and come back and get it all. You know Rust, but you've never played it. I feel you, Fear Factor. It's pretty damn fun, and in VR, with all the shenanigans, you can get up to body language and just screaming at people with open mics. Like, door camping people in VR, it's gonna be so fun. <laughs> it's just a game where you just harass your friends. Well, I mean, usually you're working together with your friends, but in this case, like... Bro, the only people that are on the server are friends, so... We're gonna fight our friends, but uh, it's just it's just a lot of chaos. There's a lot of backstabbing. It's like a big game of Among Us, in my, in my opinion. There's a lot of social aspects of the game that really sell me on Rust. So, should be fun, chat. It should be fun. All right, we gotta break more shit down. We're just chilling, later, Chunkla. You want ads? I haven't gotten any. Jacob, roll the ads just for Jacob. Stream's lagging for you? Is anyone else lagging, chat? Are we good? I think it's fine, right? 
They're working on a DayZ uh, clone as well. That one might be further out, I don't know. I forget. You guys are good. Uh, Chet. Chet. Can we break anything else off? Or down? Okay, so you can't break down the solar panels or the lights. Can you break ladders down? Yes. Probably a bed too. Uh, there's another pipe. Mm, we've got lots of extra pickaxes. I'm just gonna start breaking down extra things. I need scrap as fast as I can. It's a good way to get it. How much scrap have we gotten so far, chat? 250? Okay, that's a lot. See, if we can just do this one or two more times, we're gonna be good. We'll, we'll have scrap we need for the big important stuff and then just we'll want extras later. Uh, let's break this last one down. I'll grab all these goodies. I mean, dude, look at how much stuff we have. I should just run this back. I should probably run this back to the base. It's it's a lot of loot. I'd hate to, to lose it right now. Let's get back home. See anybody near? I think I'm by myself. Hopefully it's safe. Yo, Mickey. Glad you like the vids. Welcome to the lives. I kind of needed to grab some wood and bring it home, too. Maybe I have enough. Let me hit a tree for a little bit. I forgot to break down the spacesuit. Hopefully that's enough wood. 250, oh dude, yeah. I forgot we got a bunch from breaking down some of the other stuff. We should be fine, chat. Hello, Splat, first time chatter. Are the UK boys gonna come out of the woodworks because of the late stream? Maybe. You called me Mickey, I'm Mikey. Hi, Mikey. <laughs> All right, let's go, chat. Dump the goods off. Should be fine. Hello, Jim Hoffy. Good to see your name. What am I ending? I don't know, whenever I feel like it, chat. I have no set end date. All I know is I want to grind and farm in this game for a little bit. When I say a little bit, probably like a couple hours. You know why, chat? Let me tell you, let me bring you if I share you what with you what the goals that I have for this server that I've been luckily given a chance to be a part of, um, you might you 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 might be on the same page with me of like you just need to play twenty four hours a day, like you just need to play all day to uh, it's a good goal. You need to do that as fast as you can. So basically, one of my main goals is like if I can research all the high end stuff, I can just start being. A fun nuisance. A fun reason for people to test out PvP, okay? We need someone who's out here just shooting people. <laughs> like, anyone I see, I find your base, uh, I might just blow into it. Like, I just, <laughs> I just kind of want to be a nuisance chat because that's what Rust is. And we need to test those things out. And if everyone's just like, oh, friendly, 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 like, no one's shooting each other. I'm gonna help with that, chat. I'm gonna help <laughs> create some trust issues. Uh, hi, Short Stack. I'm gonna, it's gonna be a good time. Ooh, Short Stack is on the server too. He plays as well. I don't know if he's on right now, but. Mm, he's here. Okay, so chat, I need to build the research bench. So let's craft that. Um, Do I have what I need for it? Research table. 
I need metal frags and I need scrap. I have both, but sometimes things just take a little, oh, I need to make it add a workbench. So I need a workbench first. Okay, so we make a workbench. Maybe we'll expand. We might do another expansion on the base real quick too. I can show you building chat. Um, expand a little bit. Got the wood. I don't have any stone though, huh? We've got a little bit of stone, not much. I think we'll just build it out of wood. I do have lots more scrap here. Okay, let's make sure I don't have my scrap on me. Let's go outside. Fuck, I need it for the workbench though. Just don't want to be carrying it outside. It's not a good idea. We've got 17 more seconds on the workbench. Fuck it, we ball. Going out, I don't see anybody. All right, chat, here's, here's some building. So you take the, this with both your hands, you pull the trigger, and look, we got this nice little cool fucking wheel. Isn't that awesome? I love the design of this. Um, We can do an expansion this way. I just don't want to get too big, chat. Maybe I make this a stairwell. This could be a stairwell. Hmm. stairs look like um it'll be a bit annoying hmm what are the better stairs maybe you stairs you stairs will be annoying to get into as well slightly better maybe annoying is good though chat annoying might be good let's go with annoying then it's going to be harder for other people to get in. Okay, we'll put a door here. And we'll build some walls. I don't know if they're facing the right way, but we'll see. And then... I kind of want a little building here, chat. Then we can utilize the second floor finally. They say we do this. And we can have a little roof access. So let's make another doorway here. And I think I'm happy with that. I like the roof access here. Let's close it off. Good. Um, I might not have the resources to upgrade all of this. I kind of want to go straight to metal if I can. I need to make the doors though, chat. But I think I'll put the workbench and stuff in there. Speaking of which, is it done crafting? Chad, where is it? It's because I put the wood away? Ah, uh, because I put the scrap away. I thought I kept the scrap on me. No, it's all here. Damn it. Okay, I gotta requeue it. How much extra metal do I have? Kind of a lot, chat. Kind of a lot. Let me take some of this metal. I need metal to upkeep the base. So your base, depending on how big you get it, requires more resources per day just to maintain or else it'll decay over time. So that's why like building the base out is a nice thing, but you have to account for the extra resource cost that it's gonna take to upkeep it. So if you go crazy and just build like a massive base, you better be able to keep up with the resources cause it's a lot. So I start small and I usually expand. I build like little module ba modular bases and then expand them over time. Uh, I say we start queuing up doors as well. Where are the doors? Where are the metal doors, chat? Metal doors. We need how many? One, two, we need three if we can. 
one, two, bench is done. Three doors, which means I need three code locks. Let's craft those. And then, what else do I need? That's it, right? God, if I get shot right now, I'm in a lot of trouble. I think we're okay. Okay, doors are coming through. Let's grab them. We gotta build up this base chat before anyone finds us. We gotta act quick out here. Put a door there. And then I'm gonna start upgrading things to metal. I think I have enough to do metal. And then we just need wood stairs, fuck it. I don't have enough wood. Let's I'll do those later. It's gonna be expensive. I don't know if I can do the whole thing in metal. Maybe just the bottom floor would be good in metal. Where people can access it and blow it up. So I have to consider like explosives chat, like, or just someone shooting the wall, or, you know, I don't know, throwing Molotovs if it's made of wood or thatch, like the better materials I put through, the more it can withstand uh, a little bit of wear and tear or explosions as people try and break into this base. You know what I mean? This roof should be metal. <sighs> yeah, I think this top one's gonna have to be stone. I don't have enough metal to spend on it. Let's get the other doors down though. Um, Put a door there. I do need a doorway here. Lots of airlocks. Workbench. Maybe we put the workbench down below? Yeah, where should we put the workbench? Down below good? Timeless is here. Is he lurking? He's looking for me. Um, I think workbench can go down here. Will it fit under the stairs, chat? Doesn't look like it wants to fit under the stairs. Okay, it's gonna have to go up above then. Just wanna line it up nicely. Okay, good. Oh, let me build it, chat. Let me build it. Research table. I need the metal frags. I need to go down and grab them. Hello? Someone here? My code lock stopped crafting too. Hello? Mm. Chat, I'm getting paranoid. I can't be found. Ah, <laughs> uh, shit. I'm gonna have to take all the metal frags. I need to grab more, for sure. Do I have enough? We need at least one code lock. It's gonna take a hundred. How much did it cost for the, uh, for the research table, chat? Dude, the fact that door opens there kind of sucks. It works though, we can get in. Ah, uh, research table. It's 200, that's not bad, we can do that. Cabling tool, hmm. I think we have enough for the other code locks too. What do I need? I need just one more code lock would be nice. And then we're gonna have to go get more supplies. But chat, you guys can kind of see the gameplay loop here, right? Where, okay, we got some extra stuff out on our trip. Uh, now it's time to bring it back, spend it. I mean. I need to put a code lock on the front door here. Or else people can just open it. Uh, chat, close your eyes. <laughs> How do I punch in my code without anyone seeing? 
some snipers out here trying to trying to steal my uh, my code. They could just walk right into the base if they know that. So you gotta you gotta keep it safe. <gasps> Search table. Let's go. Okay. No! I didn't mean to. Please tell me I can pick it up. Okay. Thank God. It's like one of the worst placements for it. What the? Uh-oh. I did something weird. I dropped... Okay. I dropped the item? While it was on deploy mode? Okay, now it's acting weird. I definitely broke something. Let's try that again. Uh, Where do I want this thing? Probably right here is good. Okay. Ah, uh, we can put the scrap in here. Chat, I think we need more scrap. This door needs to be code locked. Chat, we need more scrap. Am I out? I can do one more code lock. Yeah, we're gonna have to go out and get supplies here in a sec. Let me go see if there's any more scrap. There might be some somewhere. Mm, scrap, scrap, scrap. Split this. Uh... Chat, there's no more scrap. No more scrap. Okay, so once I'm done, I'm just gonna finish some touches around the base and turn it into wood. Uh, I'll see if I have enough scrap to at least research the C4. Maybe it's enough, chat. Maybe it's enough. Uh, no. It's not. It costs 500. So we need to get some more. Put these code locks on, and then I need to set the code. But I have to blind chat to do it. So let me just make this wood, since at least something. I'm out of wood. Yeah, we gotta go farming chat for resources. All right, close your eyes, Chad. Don't peek. Don't look. Don't look at my code. Oh no! I hope you didn't see that. And if you did, I'll fucking I'll find you. We good? I think we're good. Are we good? I think we're good, chat. Ah, oh, they could blow through the ceiling. Yeah, we need to get supplies. We, we, we need to get supplies now. Anyone can blow into this very easily up there. So let's go grab some more shit. And we'll go fix the problems with the base, chat. We will fix the base. Hopefully. I kind of want to break down some of these extra suits. Just for some quick scrap. I think I'm going to, chat. I'm going to break these down. Get rid of the damn rock. Damn ass rock. Uh, I don't think anything else in here breaks down. Got arrows. I think we're good. How's my food and water? It's decent. All right, let's go. All right, so I need wood. I need stone. I need metal. We need kind of everything. Wood's gonna be the main fuel for all of our shit. We could do like a barrel run chat. If you guys are familiar with <gasps> What is that? 
Hello? Did you see that? Something just dropped out of the sky over there. Did you guys see that? What is that? Airdrop? Chat, there, like, something came by and dropped a box from the sky. What the fuck was that? There's no map in the game, so it's super easy to get lost, chat. So, I'm trying to remember that it was in that direction, but it seemed really far. Like, incredibly far. I just need to remember this general direction, and maybe we can find it. I've never seen anything like that before. Are there actually airdrops programmed in the game already? I'm not even going to turn my head, chat, because I want to keep it locked in this direction. I need to remember it's over there. Like I said, the map is massive. It's terribly easy to get lost. Do I have a bunch of stuff on me that I care about? I guess the extra suits. That would suck to lose. Other than that, I think I'm okay. Hello? It's spoon fed! Mm. Mm. I'll take that back, Mr. Spoon. Yes. You are now dead. Thanks for access to the video game that you made. That is my payment. I'm taking your rock. So Chad, that's what you look like if you're just asleep on the ground. Like if you're logged out of the game, your character just sleeps wherever you were last. Uh, so we found Spoon. <laughs> and I now have his rock. Where was that airdrop? It was somewhere off this way, chat. Somewhere off this way. Yeah, everyone's an astronaut. We're here on Mars. We're all astronauts, man. He said sorry about your base? <laughs> Why are you saying sorry? Look, Spoonfed, if you, if you find my base just by watching stream and then go destroy it, total scumbag moves. Now, if you find it naturally and you raid it, then fair game. That's that's the name of the game, baby. Uh, well, sorry about your. You know what? Let's. Where's Spoonfed's base? Where's Spoonfed's base? <laughs> Chat. Who knows? Oh, raid his ass. Maybe he's distracting me with this airdrop just to get me away from the base so he could blow it up. Chat. That would be very sad. I do need to focus. This airdrop is very distracting. I should not have ran over here. We just need to get this. Did I just see someone? Ah, what if the airdrop has cool stuff in it though? But as the clock's ticking, Spoonfed might be blowing into the side of my house. <laughs> oh shit. Hello? You have a gun? Did I hit him? No fucking way. He's running. I hit him. Who is that? <laughs> oh, he got a fucking gun, an SMG. Yeah, blow all your ammo, do it. Blow all your ammo, do it. Arrows take quite a bit to travel. God. Has he hit me at all, chat? How hurt am I? 
I'm not hurt at all. How many arrows do I have left, though? Seven? Kind of want to just push him if he's out of ammo. I just don't want to push him close if he has an SMG. Maybe he's out of ammo, though. Didn't hit. Hit. <laughs> Come back here. Who am I fighting? Who am I fighting? I'm almost out of arrows, chat. I'm out of arrows. He hit me. He gave me an arrow, though. Wait, aren't there a bunch of arrows I could pick up here? There's arrows everywhere here, right? How do I heal? Trying to heal? Did I use the heal? Shit! <laughs> Hold on, there's arrows here, chat. I need to pick them up. There's arrows everywhere! Okay, I know a bunch of them came over here too, right? I need four arrows! Oh, he's running. I gotta chase this. Alright, how many arrows did I pick up? We got five. There might be more up here. Arrow. He's running. There he is. I need to shoot higher. I'm chasing this guy. I don't know who it is, but I'm fighting him. Is it timeless? I wonder if he got airdropped too. Like I don't have any arrows left. I'm trying to look for any extras on the ground that I've shot. He's still running. I think I need a gap close, chat, before I shoot more. Just not enough arrows. Where's he going? Come back! Chad, who do you think this is? It might be Artie. We're just so far from each other. I need to cut him off if I can. I don't know how many arrows he has. <laughs> I wonder what he's got that he's so concerned for running from. Wait, maybe I could do a clutch play and grab some stones on the way over and build more arrows while I chase him. I'm trying to cut him off as much as I can. We're the same run speed chat, so it's gonna be tough. I need to take another shot. Oh, I was so close! Oh my god, I'm so close! Ooh, thanks for the arrow. <laughs> Give me that. <laughs> Imagine picking up the arrow that just got shot at you. Is it timeless? <laughs> Where's he going? Come back here, bitch! Bro, I only got one arrow left. Fight me! You probably got like a billion. 
Bro, quit running! Where'd he go? Lost him around the corner! No! What? No! Come here. Get away from me, get away from me. Get away from me. Bro, can I just never gap close? How many arrows you got? <laughs> Stop! Stop! <laughs> Bro, just give me your arrows! <laughs> give me your... Ow! Give me the arrows! <laughs> Quick! Like crossbow? He's running again. Get back here, Artie! <laughs> Fight me! Oh, he's giving me more arrows. I I'm gonna find him. I'm following him to his base. You're gonna have to either kill me, Artie, or die, or I'm coming to your base. <laughs> You're not losing me. I'm coming for his ass, chat. Oh yeah, give me more arrows. Thanks, man. Hmm. I love getting free arrows from my enemies. Love you, Artie! <sighs> I think we can track him down. How's my health chat? Am I good? I'm trying to get it to pop up. I don't know. Yeah, is my health good? <laughs> Hi, Cryptic. <laughs> Short stack just lolling. Where'd he go? He went around this corner somewhere. Artie! Which way did he go, chat? There he is. <laughs> he thinks he's lost to me. Little does he know I'm coming right for him. Okay, he's, he's pretty far ahead. I can't lose him. He might lead me right to his base. Which would not be a good thing for him. <laughs> Don't lead me to your base, Artie. Just come fight me. What does he have on him? Do you think he got the airdrop? I think he got the airdrop? Because he was running from that direction. Artie. Artie. Where are you going? Imagine. Oh, that was so close. Oh! That was so close. <laughs> Get back here, you piece of shit. <laughs> yes, free arrows from my enemy. Oh, that one went a little farther. Give me more! Wait, is he have a teammate? There's a teammate on the hill. There's someone up above. Kill him, whoever's up there. Get his ass. Or am I getting ambushed right now? Am I the one getting set up for an ambush? Dude, there's another player up there. Am I about to get ambushed? What's happening here? Is this guy up here gonna kill me? Am I about to get shot? I'm gonna flash my lights at him. Yo, can you hear me? Yo! Okay. Is this how we wanna play? Did he fall off and die? <laughs> Where is he? He's got a gun of some sort. I don't really have arrows for this. Ch 
Now, how many arrows do I have left? I have two. <sighs> I need to kill him with two arrows. How do I kill him with two arrows? I don't think I can. Unless I push him or something. Yeah, I need to find a rock. Where's your gun at? Where's, gun, where's your gun at? It's in my hand. Oh hands. yeah, is it? <laughs> is it? Come here, it's about to be in my hands. How did I miss? <laughs> You're gonna die. You're gonna die. I'm gonna die. Goodbye. Yeah. That's awkward. <laughs> Come here, you little shit! <laughs> ah! <Yeah>. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Motherfucker! No! God damn it, timeless! You fucking. You, I ran out of arrows, man. If I had more arrows, it would be great. <laughs> if I stole his bolty, he's gonna get it off my dead body. But that shit's so funny. Holy fuck, that shit is so funny. All right, we go in naked. We go in naked. Nothing but a rock. Far from me either. Uh, that was a good fight though. <laughs> Damn it. I couldn't get the hit reg to work on the melee on those last couple swings and time was like hit me over the fucking head with it. <laughs> Dude, the fucking S bobbing and weaving is classic arrest behavior <laughs> when someone's trying to shoot you. <laughs> it's just... <sighs> it's so much fun. Oh my god. Good night, D Vader. I'm, just, I'm glad you thought that was funny, chat. Those bitches are right over there, too. I know where Artie's house is. He, he led me right to it. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Artie's house. Mmm. I wonder what I'm gonna do with that. With that knowledge. I mean, I assume that that's his house. I mean, he ran right into it and didn't come back out. He must have had some decent stuff on him, too. Alright, chat, I'm naked. I almost want to go to airfield. If there's no respawns here for boxes, I might just go to airfield and then um, we'll try and scrounge up a bunch of gear there. The problem is... Hmm... The problem is, chat, I need to research the C4 instantly. I, I need to stop getting sidetracked. While that was very fun, PvPing and fighting them. Um, yeah, it's artificial intelligence and timeless. That's what we just ran into. Uh, yeah, they're playing around the world right now. I, I need to finish researching it, chat. I gotta stop getting distracted. We've got a plan, we've got a goal. Let's hit it. All right, do we get any respawns? I so I can go straight for the big tower to check. I don't think we do, though. I think I just bounce, chat. I think I just bounce. I don't see any crate respawns here at all. Let's go to a different monument. I just need to be careful, they might, <laughs> they might be close by. 
I thought Ty was gonna start shooting Artie for me. But now he started shooting me. <laughs> uh, I gotta love the Rust interactions. They're so fun. Grim. Let's eat some mushrooms. Can I not actually grab those? Me. Mushrooms will help fill our food and water a little bit, so pretty nice little item. And then let's get on the road, chat. Let's go live on the road. How am I playing? No. <laughs> I got invited. What's your real name, Tan? Says Force Tabor. Um, what's the quickest way to get permaband? <laughs> This is Grim Chat. Yeah, I'll do a little testing. Alright, I can't see Dick. I think there's a road here. Uh chat, there's a the airfield's kind of far. I don't remember which direction it is. I mean I guess we could just follow a random road and just loot what we find. I don't want to break barrels until I get like a better thing to break barrels with, though. I'm not breaking it with a fucking rock. Unless it only takes four hits. No, that takes way longer. Gimme springs. Alright, tell us roll. Ah, uh, where the fuck is the airfield? It's too dark for me to tell where anything is. I'm gonna try and find it. Because I know how to get there once I get on the right road. Maybe this is the right road. I don't think it is. I just can't see, chat. I can't see! No, this is definitely not right. Okay, back into the dome. I just need to check some of the other uh, exits and entrances to the dome for a landmark that I have secretly identified and placed. Uh, and then I'll be able to head the right way. Bop. Let's go back in. It's definitely not this doorway. I should keep the light off to stay hidden. Here, I'll give I'll give some mid-tier extra bucks out. Uh, midway through. I know some of you guys need to go to bed. It is very late. Chat, hold on, I got you. Give me some. More to come later. But I'll give you a little, uh, a little taste. Those of you who made it to the end of the video, I see you. I appreciate you. Double check that you're subscribed as it helps a ton. Give a like if you feel the video deserved it. And I read all of your comments, so let me know what you think below. If you want to be a part of chat, come check out the live streams. I stream Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday, always at 3.30 p.m. PST for start time. I'd love to see you there. And until next time.